Hey guys, this is our last full day in Vegas. Uh, I actually got I, what I believe to be a good six and a half, seven hours of sleep last night. I'm feeling good and because we canceled our dinner reservations, we don't have to be anywhere at a specific time. So I want to try to get some of the things done that I haven't been able to do the entire time we've been here just because of how I've been feeling. Um, so uh, the plan right now is to go down and play blackjack, um, find somewhere in the mall, uh, in the Miracle Mile Shopping Center to eat dinner. They have lots of fantastic restaurants. And then uh, High Roller, which I will vlog. Uh, we are trying to get to the High Roller as close to dusk slash night as possible because the last time we went on the high roller, we did it during the day. So we thought it would be fun this time to do it the opposite. I will vlog some of that and uh, maybe a little bit of shopping after. Um, but I've done a little tiny bit of shopping, not a whole bunch. And I didn't really do any vlogs. I mean, like you saw maybe in one of my vlogs where I had the RuPaul shirt on. I also bought like a Congratulations fan. Um, we bought uh, we bought a few other things, but like no like super huge shopping hauls. Um, you know, kind of bought some souvenirs for the kids. So I really didn't think that that was worthy of vlogging. Uh, we did go into Michael Kors uh, to get a purse, and there was one purse that I kind of liked, but. I don't think I liked it quite. I mean, I've been thinking about it and thinking about it. I took the day to think about it, and I feel like maybe uh, I didn't like it enough to spend $500 on it. Um, so I don't think that I'm going to get it. Um, at this point, I'm pretty sure I'm not going to get it. There was only one person in the whole store that drew me to it, but it wasn't like normal. Like my husband would say, normally I'm like, ooh, I want that one. And I wasn't necessarily like that with this purse. It's just, it was a cool purse. It was a shade of purple that I don't own and it had studs all over it. And it was a pretty purse, but I just wasn't like, ooh, I really need that. So I think I'm just going to decline on the purse situation. Oh, we also stepped into Jimmy Choo and all the shoes <laughs> that they had on display, uh, minus the Cinderella shoe, all the shoes they had on display, if I liked it, I've already bought it. I already own it. <laughs> so uh, minus the Cinderella shoe, but that is a $5,000 shoe. Uh, and it's not a special occasion, so I would not spend that on a shoe. Typically, my price range for a Jimmy Choo shoe is under $1,500. Uh, you know, the Bailey shoes for the wedding were $3,000, but that was because it was a special occasion. So, and I would have spent the 5000 on the Cinderella shoe had I not fallen in love with the Bailey shoe. Uh, so with that being said, there was nothing in Jimmy Choo that jumped out at me either. <laughs> um, but there's always next year. So anyway, we're going to get off here. We're going to go downstairs and play some blackjack. We'll see you at dinner and we'll see you at the high roller. And if we come across any type of shopping that is amazing that we want to haul, then I'll do a haul before we leave. But uh, that's it. Tomorrow is checkout at, oh, hold on, my arm's getting sleepy or tired. <laughs> uh, tomorrow is checkout at 11 a.m. And uh, what was I saying? Oh, and then it's just three days on the road back home. Most unlikely I won't vlog any of that. Uh, that's pretty boring, just driving. I, mean, I might show you the rooms that we stay in. Yeah, I'll probably show you the rooms, but like I'll combine the last three into maybe like one video, just because you'll only see the rooms and then possibly what we eat for dinner. So yeah, that sounds like a good plan. That way it's not three separate videos of just kind of boring shit. So anyway, we'll see you later on today. Bye. What's pickled though? Is this a pepper? No. No, it's guac. <laughs> it's guac shaped like a pepper.
So if I didn't mention the restaurant beforehand or show it, uh, that was Flights in the Miracle Mile shopping mall. Uh, and it was good. It was really good. Uh, yeah, i say it's a good four and a half uh, for some casual dining. Um, I can't think straight. We're headed out to the high roller. Uh, so we're not sure if it's actually open or not because the Google says one thing and the website says another, so we're not entirely sure if it's open. We are going to walk down there, and uh, if so, then we'll show you. <laughs> Bye. We changed our mind. <laughs> um, we didn't realize how late it was, and we kind of want to be back up to the room by 9 o'clock so we can get packed up and get into bed at a reasonable time for checkout tomorrow. So we are just going to go downstairs and play more bla bleh, Black Jack. So, uh... See you later. Bye.